McGregor, Iowa, USA, July 4, 2017, filmed approximately two weeks before the tornado went down the main street of McGregor, Iowa. Here you see the Quick Star, nice little gas station. On the other side of this ridge of grass there is the Mississippi River. Behind the green box is a public restroom. And we're going to take a left here on Main Street. Right there on the right with the red, white, and blue decorations is a little hotel and they have ice cream. On the left is a Triangle Park and they have uh, little plays that they can put on during the summer. There's also, uh, they had a piano there that people could just take the cover off and play. Right there on that street on the right um, there was a little commemorative uh, box with uh, for the Ringling Brothers which got their start in McGregor. And there were seven brothers and one sister that started the uh, American Circus the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus. And we're driving down Main Street here. And right there, the building on the right by the Willow and this red one here, right there on the right, were destroyed in the uh, tornado, the July 2017 tornado. And we're gonna take a right here by the library and we're going to show you a house called the Hunter Mansion. It's a private residence. Coming up, it's at the end of this street. And uh, the original builder of the mansion was a person who had uh, started a grain transportation business out of McGregor. There it is. There you see it. Then we're going to go down this street here. And one day we were driving down this road and you could see uh, there was a, a doe that had two little fawns and they were drinking out of a uh, bird bath. They were kind of, it was a hot day, so I suppose they were looking for a drink. Nice, cool, refreshing drink there. And uh, there goes Skippy across the road. You got lots of wildlife in the area, especially deer. And uh, if you are driving in the area, you need to be aware of deer, especially at night. But uh, like I said, we, it was during the day and we saw the deer right in this residential area as well. They come out of the, the hills there with the trees, lots of trees. There's kind of an interesting uh, building coming up here at the very end. And it looks like it might have been uh, some sort of uh, hotel, maybe, at the turn of the century. There you can see it. it's got the two ridges there. It looks like it has several rooms across the, the bottom right there behind the white flowers. Looks like there's another Victorian house. And you'll see the red brick building there on the left-hand side of the screen. 
And that's one that got destroyed in the tornado. And that tree there just got snapped off. Just like it was a matchstick or something. The tornado, I believe, was uh, July 19th of 2017. Now we're driving towards the out of town. There's a congregational church there on the left. There's some apartments on the left. And then coming up, I believe there's a, like a bed and breakfast and I believe a uh, funeral home as well. And as you're coming up to this intersection, you'll see a church straight ahead. If you take a left there, you'll go out to Pikes Peak State Park, which I highly recommend. It has some very beautiful uh, sights of the Mississippi River. And we're going to go take a back street here. And you'll see these people here on the left. They're crossing the street there to get to a uh, little park there. Park for kids to play. Now I have to warn you, if you're curious about driving, there's a school on the left here. If you're curious about driving up the hill where we're going to go, um, you're going to need to have a very, very big pickup to get up there because uh, you would have to turn around and come back down otherwise. Um, it's They made a ridge at the very top of the hill up there so that the water doesn't wash so bad and uh, you won't make it with a car. You'll scrape bottom. So you might just want to find a place to park at the bottom and just walk up there if you're curious. We did drive up there with a really, really big pickup, a 2500 series, and uh, it did scrape bottom. We were going very, very slow, but just, just so you know that. So here we go. There is a an A-frame up there that is, uh, at this time, uh, was available for rent, and you can check with one of the online uh, home rental businesses that there there is online and uh, search under McGregor, Iowa and you, you'll probably be able to find it that way. This is where it gets really really steep up in here. I can't imagine going up here in the winter time You go past the first A-frame and go to the second one. And that road that goes straight ahead, that's where you're going to need the pickup. Otherwise you're going to need to turn around. If you're not a good person who too can back up, if your backing skills are lacking, I would suggest walking up here if you want to see it. And there's a lot of wildlife in behind there. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.